Somehow, our lives have become plagued with cheap, fast rewards. We are manipulated by systems that subliminally drive us towards actions and consequences that we may not necessarily like. We may not explicitly realize it, but this mode of acting was encouraged from a very early time in our schooling. It was fostered by a teaching style that sidelined curious exploration in favor of reward seeking. We learned to be conditioned to learn and we lost our ability to spontaneously self-discover. We forgot how to wonder, reformulate, and innovate. But new research on how infants teach themselves is showing us how to be creative again and to avoid the overuse of goal-oriented, rewards-based learning. Instead of giving children a goal, research suggests that it is better to let them curiously wonder, explore, and surprise themselves with new knowledge. Doing so increases children's ability to acquire autonomy, self-motivate, think critically in creative ways, and even think in altruistic, humanitarian ways to help others in need. Autistic children especially prefer this mode of learning during early years of schooling. Give spontaneity and curious learning a chance for all children and you'll discover their learning preferences as they become ready for instruction. Some will be natural explorers and take bigger risks, while others will prefer logical rules. But all will appreciate not being manipulated by others. Endowing children with this type of spontaneous, autonomous exploration in their formative schooling years will pave their way toward an independent adult life with dignity.